What up, world? It's your girl, Anita B, a.k.a. Young Show, a.k.a. Back with another video. Nah, but for real, though, scratch that. Welcome back to the channel, y'all, man. It's been a couple days since my last video, since I let y'all, you know, know what my health issues was and how crazy that was for me. So, the doctor gave me some bad news. <clears throat> I'm going to have to change up my diet the way I live. And all this stuff like that. But before I do that, I'm going to go out with a bang, man. I'm going to have me a big cheat day. Like, I'm going to be eating everything I can today. I'm going to try to eat like one of them my 106-pound life type meals today. Man, I'm going to eat breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, between snacks, smoothie snacks, nighttime snacks, all the snacks. I'm just going to be eating today because this is the last day. I can eat any type of fast food, fried food, good food, any type of food. Because basically what I'm going to have to do, I'm going to have to do a detox. I'm going to have to do a, it's more like a juicing type of situation. But before I get into that, I'm going to go ahead and show my ass today. I'm just going to eat everything. I'm not even going to cap. I'm going to try to eat so much that when I detox, it's going to hurt. But. I got to go out with a bang. I got to do it. And, Doc, listen, Doc, if you watch my channel, because I told you about it, I know I ain't supposed to be doing this. But one more day is not going to It's not gonna hurt me. Is it? I hope it's not. I hope it's not. Because I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> so, man, look, man, if this is y'all first time coming across my channel, please subscribe to the channel if you ain't did that yet. Like these videos, man, because help me out in the algorithm. Cause that thing, it go up and down, but that's a whole nother situation. But today, y'all, y'all come with me to eat. We finna eat today. When I say we finna eat today, we finna eat, baby. We finna eat good. So, my first stop is gonna be breakfast. <laughs> y'all so first stop is wendy's let's see what they got on their breakfast menu you did i ain't had no wendy's breakfast in like never so we finna see what this about hello oh uh, yeah can i uh can i get a number seven with uh um a coke a number seven with a coke anything else and then can I get a um maple bacon chicken croissant just a sandwich? Alright y'all, so I got the food, I got the drinks. I actually got two drinks. You thought now you know I'ma get me an iced coffee, but I ain't never had them. That's called a um a frozen chino, a frappuccino, a fugiano, something like that. I don't know what it's called, but it's a vanilla fugiano. I got the homemade hash browns. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. And I got the chicken. I had to try the chicken biscuit. You know, I ain't never had a chicken biscuit. First time for everything. Then I got the breakfast baconator. Let me go see how that works. And of course, you know, I got some ketchup and I got some jellies. So before we put anything in our mouth, in our mouth, in our mouth, or beside it, Let's go ahead and bottom heads. Y'all know what to do. Bottom heads. Stop being rude. Bow. All right. Let me get something to drink. I'm going to taste that coffee first because I know what a coat tastes like. Let me see what this coffee hitting on. I didn't have better. Okay, so we're going to go with the chicken biscuits since I never had one of these. Let's go to two. I get a Caniac box with two extra toasts and two extra sauces. You want to call Sly with a video? Uh, no. 
All right, y'all. So I got my canes, and um, when I tell y'all I am about to be fat, I am about to be fat today. Like I don't even care. You feel me? Cause like I said, after today, I ain't gonna be able to eat like I want to eat. So I gotta do what I gotta do while I can do what I gotta do. And I'm just gonna be all the way out the way. I'm gonna go and make this famous TikTok sandwich that I've seen busting on TikTok. Give me one of these here. Oh, and it's fresh, hot. It's hot and fresh. Put me a couple of them fries on there, skedaddle. Oh, if y'all see this, it's so hot, y'all. Oh, it's still so hot. That's how I know it's going to be busted at the seams. Oh, yes, indeed. It feed the needy. Look at it. Look at it. How they sun hitting off that thing when that thing hit that sun. Ooh, look at it, Joe. It looks spicy as hell. Ooh. Alright, so they told me I had to eat it with these uh with the ruffles. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go try it. Give me a good dip. Give me a good dip. Let me see. Try to get everything on it, which I put pickles, jalapenos, banana peppers, Big Mama gas station sausages, eggs, all that. Plus, I'm gonna see what this like real quick. Let me see. Y'all want a bite? Mmm. No, no cap. This is buzzing, y'all. That is up. Mmm. I see why it went viral. It ain't too spicy, it's just right. Just right, that I like it. Ooh. Mm. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. So I'm back. I got my food, and I went. I went home, and I got me a good old down home cheeseburger made by yours truly. If anybody from where I'm from know, Fanny Burgers is the best burger that ever came through that little town. And I had to go and get me one before I go and shut down the fast food thing. But man. Did I tell y'all it's hot? Like, man, I don't know how I'm going to make it this summer, man. Summer just came in. You ain't have to kick the dough in like that. Summer, God dang. Spring went out with all the rain, and then summer going to come in with 104 degree weather. Like, bro, summer, summer walk. Sit your ass down somewhere. Turn the fan on. It's hot. But look, in my last meal, I don't know why they put these big-ass onions like for real i like onion but i don't want a whole slab of onion you feel me just one or two one or two rings will do don't don't do all that don't do all that but this burger look good as hell this burger look good as hell y'all so let me let me get y'all for a bite after i get all these onions out lord have mercy what then it's just juicy it's juicy it's slimy it's good i love it Hold on. There you go. Ew, it's juicy, slimy, nasty, dirty. I love a good slimy burger. I don't want nothing dry. I know how some people like slimy stuff. Some people like dry stuff. I know a lot of people who like condiment, but let me go and enjoy this meal before I piss for it out here. Mmm. Mmm. The fur bite. The fur bite. Lord have mercy. Be the truth. You hear me? Did I hear me? Mmm. I got some fire with the fish up. Rush it down with a bull. Mmm. Y'all. I mean, they like a, a fat person. Cause man, I'ma miss this man. I'ma miss. Cause um, for those of you 
who didn't watch my last video. I had a health scare, you feel me? Well, I had to be in the hospital for a little while, you know what I'm saying? Because y'all know, for the ones who've been my day one, you know, I had, I had posting like almost a month. And, you know, the ones who care, you know, hit me up in the in the box. Hit me up in my box and um, were asking me what was going on. So it was on the right that I came back and, you know, let y'all know that. Man, when your girl had the health scare, man, it was scary. You know, having colonitis. For the ones who know in the back, colonitis is when your your large intestines inflame on you. And, you know, it can get chronically bad. Like, it can really be bad. And, you know, I was trying to be thug. You know, I was trying to be hard about it. And I didn't go to the doctor until I had to go to the doctor. You feel me? So, I got to change up my diet a little while. You know what I'm saying? Doing these mukbangs. Am I sweating? <laughs> Doing these mukbangs and... You know, eating all this food and doing all these challenges is really not good for, you know, everyday consumption. <laughs> I'm going to do a detox. Matter of fact, I'm going to do two de detoxes in 14 months. I've been doing my research. I've also talked to my doctor. I'm going to do a cleansing detox where I go with no food, no, no water, none of that. A dry detox is what they call it. I'm going to do that for three days. No, I'm lying. I'm going to have water because, you know, you got to stay hydrated. I'm going to do a three-day water uh, fast, which is going to detox all the toxins out of my body. Then after that, I'm going to do another fast where I'm only, cons well, it's called juicing. If y'all know what juicing is, I'm going to do a juicer. And what that's supposed to do is I'm going to make a concoction of like melons and I think ginger and carrots and stuff like that. So y'all, I don't me a juicer, which is gonna help me get to where I need to get. But I ain't gonna count, man. I'm so scared, yo. Not because it's gonna be nasty or nothing like that, but I ain't never just went cold turkey where I eat no type of food without chewing on nothing while I doing it. I don't know how I'm going to handle it. It's going to be something different. But it's necessary. So, I told my doctor, look here, play off. I'm going to have to at least have one more good meal. One more good one before I go ahead and throw in the towel. One more. And that's why I chose. Yeah, I could have went to McDonald's. I could have went to Wendy's, Taco Bell. I don't like that. But ain't nothing like home, you feel me? So I came home. It's what I grew up on. Boom. My last meal. And... Honestly, I really want to stop, like, eating this type of stuff all together because of all the hormones and stuff they putting in it and the toxic stuff they putting in these foods, like, like, the chemicals and all that. Like, man, I work at a poultry plant where we cut up chicken all day. And when I tell you the chemicals that they put in our chicken these days is strong. Like, look, the chemicals be so strong in the plant sometimes. Well, I can't even breathe clearly without my nose running or my nose getting, my mouth getting dry or something like that. So I'm like, if it's not safe for me to inhale it, why would it be safe for me to digest it? It's, the, it's like, like I'm just at the point where they, I, they, you know, they don't care. But good. <laughs> Man, it's hot. Man, I'm going to eat every drop of this food. No cap. I'm telling you. Man, y'all let me know, man. Y'all let me know. Like, have you know, anybody ever had colonitis before? 
really, really shut down my whole body. Me, I just went back to work not too long ago. Like, that's real talk. Don't put this food over your health, man. And look at me, I ain't got a little chunky. I'm getting a little double chin. That's why. That's why I really need to put this stuff down. But this is my last meal for a while. And yes, I'm going to be documenting everything. Not just for y'all, but for my personal keep. You know, because life is a journey. It's not a destination. And the um the more I mature I get, because I ain't getting old. Don't nothing get old but clothes. That's what my grandma told me. The more mature I get, the more I grow. I'm starting to choose me over a lot of stuff. I'm choosing peace. Self-love, all that stuff. It comes from within. And also, I know, whatever reality you think. But let me rephrase that. Let me rephrase that. Anything you think will become your reality. You feel me? So, if you want the best, you gotta start. It gotta start with you. Not outside. So, Y'all keep that in mind. Life is a journey, not a destination. Please allow yourself to make mistakes and do crazy things. But the key to it is to learn from it. You understand me? You understand? <laughs> I can go a little deep. You know I know a little stuff now. Mama ain't raised no nothing. Yeah, you know, I got one bite left. I'm trying to save it, y'all. This is my last one. God dang it. This is my last bite. Y'all wonder why I'm looking at my neighbors in the middle of moving. And it's very distracting, but... Yeah. So, alright, y'all. Last bite. Mmm. That's the one. That's the one. Oh, man, that's it. All I can say is goodbye for now until we meet again. It's been great. <laughs> Y'all remember in the box. Tripping. But yeah, man, that was my last meal, my last bite. I hope y'all go along on the journey with me. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, let y'all know, man, this is real life stuff going on. Real life stuff, real life issues. It's a no man, we can grow together. Because if we do it together, baby, we can do whatever. You can do it too, put your back into it. You feel me? Put your mind into it. Put your heart into it. Put your legs into it. Boom, boom. Come on. Let's get it. <laughs> but for real though, man. Thank y'all for watching this video. And man, I'm excited because it's, I'm nervous, but I'm ready for a change. I'm ready to be better. I'm better to do great things. Great things are only coming when you want it. So, man, let's get it. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you ain't did that yet. And, man, you already know what it is, man. Stop playing with your girl. Till next time.